This is day three of our three day 2024 virtual user workshop and we've officially come to an end. So thank you so much. As we've mentioned throughout, your feedback is important. It helps us not only improve the workshop, but also our tools, our database, uh, all of our collaborations that we have as well. It inspires new work. So um, please do pop your thoughts into the day three survey. As a reminder, you will also get a post event feedback survey in the email that we'll send. Um, so that is just as important. It just looks at everything holistically as well. So day three uh, survey is in the chat now for you. And thank you for that. Take some time to complete it now if you haven't already, but if you need a little bit more time to think when we close the webinar, it will pop up as well um, in your browser. So um, thank you there. And then lastly, we've still been sharing things on Twitter or X. If you are on the platform, follow us at IEDB underscore and post something that you found cool or interesting and use the hashtag IEDB UW 2024. And now just a quick recap of the day about four hours ago, we started off with Marcus who presented IEDB 3D 2.0 visualizing structures in the IEDB. And he presented the three viewers uh, that we have in the database now and kind of each benefit that um, the three viewers bring. And then we heard from Kelly on the IEDB query API, how to programmatically access the IEDB database information. Then we had a back-to-back -back presentation from Zainep on um, the IEDB sibling resource, the Cancer Epitope Database and Analysis Resource, or CEDA, with its purple coloring. And then Zainep gave you a sneak preview into the CEDA Neo Epitope meta-analysis work that is actively happening now and is um, being submitted for publication. So I uh, hope you enjoyed that like behind the scenes look, I suppose, of some of the work and um, how you can use the CEDA database to, to gain insights into immunology. And then just now we heard from Jennifer, the PI of the HIV Lanol Immunology database. Um, though Jennifer gave us a great overview of all of the resources, including CatNAP with real research examples as well. And then finally, we heard from Dan once again on the IEDB Uniprot and Protein Ontology and IPTMNet collaboration. Um, and that's there. So a couple of post-event reminders. You will receive a post-event email next week. Possibly within two weeks, we will do our best with the deadlines that we have coming up to get it out to you as soon as possible. But in that email, you will have the workshop recording links. So these 12 hours will be chopped up into more consumable videos and uploaded to our YouTube channel. So we will share that with you. All of the presentations will be shared with you in that email as well. Participation certificates will be provided upon request. I think I did pop this in the chat earlier, but basically the instructions will be to email your interest to the um, workshop at iedb.org. Um, and please, once again, we appreciate your patience as there's a lot of certificates to generate and turning it all around. We'll take a little bit of time, but um, rest assured, we will you know, have your request safe with us and get back to you within um, the couple of weeks after the workshop. And then uh, the post-event feedback survey. So with that, day three has now been completed and that is the end of our 2024 IADB virtual user workshop. If you do have additional questions, uh, please do email us at uh, help at iedb.org. And yeah, I can see Mauricio's message in the chat to send the link slides by email. So we'll definitely do that. There are a few tweaks to the slides um, as finals as well. So we'll make sure to send you all the final final of the final slides. So um, yes, all of that will be in the post event email. But anything that we've missed, please do email us help at iedb.org. And lastly, uh, we thank you all so much, all of our wonderful attendees, all of the people that use the IEDB, CEDA, the HIV databases, all of these resources don't really mean anything unless they have people to use them. Um, and we so appreciate the time that you've spent with us, 12 hours to be exact, over the last uh, few days. So thank you so much for your time and your interest in the IEDB and the other resources that we've spoken about over these three days. And otherwise we wish you a very happy and healthy rest of your day, week, month ahead, and we'll see you next year. <laughs>
So thank you all, all the best.